Welcome to this new video by Practical Ninjas. In the previous videos in this series on ladder logic development, we have understood how to implement AND, OR and NOT Boolean logic. If you are new to the channel and haven't checked the videos, you can find links in the description box below. For your ease, we have also put up cards in the top right corner. In this video, we will focus on examples of the Boolean logic and how to implement them using ladder logic. The first expression is y equals a or b and c or d. Looking at the expression, we can understand that the output is y and a, b, c and d are the inputs. The output y is on when either a or b or both and either c or D or both are on. The logic diagram for the following expression is shown here. The ladder diagram for the Boolean equation is as follows. We can see from the ladder logic that the inputs A and B are connected in parallel. This forms A or B. Similarly, inputs C and D are also connected in parallel. This forms C or D. Both of these are then connected in series. This gives us the desired Boolean expression. We hope that you have understood this example and its explanation. Let us move to the second example. Implement the ladder logic for the logic diagram shown here. Try to work out this example on your own before proceeding to the solution. You can pause the video here and work out the solution. Looking at the Boolean logic, let us first write the expression. The Boolean equation is Q equals A0 and B or C or D and E and F. The ladder logic for the equation is as follows. Here, we can see that NC contact is used for input A Inputs B, C and D are connected in parallel, which forms OR logic. Inputs E and F are connected in series. Now, let us simulate this ladder. The output will turn high when A is low, E and F both are high, and any one or all of B, C and D are high. If you have clearly understood this example, let us move to the next example. The expression is Q equals A or B XOR C. You can check the explanation for XOR gate in one of our videos on digital electronics. Till now, we have easily implemented AND, OR and NOT gates. Let us understand how to implement XOR gate. Let us find the expression for XOR gate. We will call this gate X for ease of understanding. Our equation then becomes Q equals A or X, where X equals B XOR C. The expression for XOR logic is X equals B C bar or B bar C. So, one can see that the XOR gate has been rewritten as a combination of NOT and and OR gates. Now, it is easy to implement this logic. First, let us create this XOR ladder logic. The ladder logic is shown here. It matches with our equation. The final ladder logic for our equation of Q is presented here. The input A is connected in parallel with the XOR of B and C. On simulating the ladder, we get the desired results. Hope you have understood the example. One can now easily create ladder logics for different gates and expressions by breaking them down into their basic gates. Until next time, stay calm and keep learning. Peace out.